50 paintings under £50,000. We love London. Paintings are of their time, but still give delight decades and centuries after they were executed. In a challenging year, looking at works of art has been a comfort and a joy. Our online exhibition, 50 Paintings Under £50,000, covers a wide range of genres, from the 18th to the 21st century. The portraits, sporting paintings, marines, flower pieces, landscapes and abstracts represent fair value and are designed to appeal to everyone, from fledgling buyers to those looking for a special work to complete an aspect of their collection. Most of us can only visit London virtually at the moment, so this selection celebrates our capital city. William James is thought to have worked in Canaletto's studio, where he lived in London from 1746 to 1755, and made a career emulating his subjects. James's view of the Horse Guards Parade, not much has changed today, depicts the dazzling white building designed by William Kent, a symbol of Georgian Britain's confidence. Edward Sego is known for his views of East Anglia, but also loved to capture the atmosphere of London. The Thames from Albert Bridge reveals his favourite themes, a sweep of a river, busy with boats, cloud-flecked skies. He brilliantly captures the gentle haze of the city, with Battersea Power Station seen on the skyline, trailing out white smoke. The gaily dressed yacht in the foreground is a reminder of Seago's yacht Capricorn, in which he often sailed the channel. Frank Albach is a distinguished member of the School of London, the group of artists who have drawn their inspiration from the teeming life of London. For the decades, he chronicled the area near his North London studio, with intense originality. St Pancras Steps, with its bold colours and graphic virtuosity, conjures art from the most ordinary of subjects, steps leading to a station. Though there is not a single figure present, the flow of life is evoked by the fizzing energy of the scene. As we watch online, let's hope we soon see the pulse of the city return in real life. Please visit our website to view the selected works and exhibition.